name is Savannah Kirkland and today we're going to be making lip gloss with my lip gloss base and I'm going to show you guys how to do that and today we're going to sing on um, dark lips. Some people smoke cigarettes and their lips get dark or different um, irrita skin irritations make their lips dark. So every ingredient that I'm putting here is going to focus on turning the lips back to its original color. Okay, I already opened it. And it's a thick base. Okay. okay. Next, you guys, I have... We got the base. Next, I have coconut oil and glycerin. And what I do is I usually stir it really good. And if you don't do that, um, you can see it kind of changing a little bit. If you don't do that, the glycerin will separate from the lip gloss. You just have to stir it up really, really well. You guys, I don't go by measurement. I go by consistency. How my lip gloss. I don't like it too thick and I don't like it too thin. And I see that... Um, some people put more oil than I would prefer. You just have to, um, you know, play with it and see what consistency you like for your personal usage or your business. And on my site, I have a kit. And you can just buy the um, lip gloss base separately or you can purchase it with the whole kit you can check that out on my website. I'm going to leave the link at the bottom. And guys, you got to really take the time out. Okay, that looks good. So right here, I have my herbal mix. You guys, I soak my herbs for six weeks. And, um, and then I drain them and I make different products with them. Let me show you how it looks. It's in a container like this, you guys. And I have a list of different herbs. And I let it sit in my pantry in the dark for six weeks. And these, all these herbs here, they, they help with um, brightening your lips back up, okay? And we're gonna take it and mix it in here. In the coconut and glycerin and then we're going to stir that and let y'all know what herbs i have i have parsley in here rosemary basil thyme cinnamon horsetail lavender and lemongrass so we're going to stir this up really really well Also, you guys, I'm using color soft pink from TKB, and I use their uh, their glitter and their pigment. And the pigment and the glitter you use, you guys, you want to make sure it's for the lips. This is a very pretty color. I don't know how dark or light I want it. I'm going to get one scoop, heaping scoop, and I'm going to put it inside my oil. Very pretty. I'm going to stir that up. 
you guys if you mix it up and you feel like you want it some more you can always put some more but I like to put it in my oil stir it up before I put it inside the um, Versadale see that's very pretty and I think I would like I think I would like two more scoops mm -hmm. And this came with the um, pigment, you guys, this little scoop. And also, um, I put vitamin E in here. And then I'm gonna put it into the Versagel. You guys, I like to use a butter knife versus a spoon. It just seems like it's it's stirred much easier. Just a beautiful clear pink. I love the consistency, you guys. Love the consistency. That's thick. I like it kind of thick. It lasts longer. And, you know, when it's thick, you don't have to use that much. A little bit go a long way. So, you guys, I'm tempted to put a little bit of glitter in here, you guys. It's pink. It's pretty the way it is. But I don't know. I think I'll leave it like this. I just made a batch of uh, glitter lip gloss. This is not going to be, be for like teenagers. It's going to be like for my smokers. You know, somebody want to brighten their lips up. This will be good. So... Last but not least, I put my, um, this is strawberry flavor, and I put about six squirts. It smells so good. Oh, that changed the texture of the color a little bit. That's pretty. Ooh. I love that. I'm gonna add a little bit more versatile. I tried different um, textures on my family members and friends, and they all like the thicker consistency. So that's what I try to make. And I like the thick consistency too. That's very pretty, you guys. Guys, I think I want to put some glitter in it. I get my glitter from TKB as well. I'm going to put a little bit of silver in. Yes, I've been making so much product that I 
ran out of gloves. Well, I do have gloves, but I have them in that location. I have a drop of the glitter. I don't want too much, you guys. So I got a drop of silver glitter. glitter. And then I'm going to put a drop of pink glitter. All right, next, you guys, um, this DC syringe, and take a little tooth and get the little, and you cut it right here. And then you connect it to the syringe. I do I cut some of this in right here 